Words to describe this past year are surreal, exhilarating, crazy, and life-changing. When I say I'm gonna do something, it's all in. It's all of my energy into one goal, and it's amazing to see all of my hard work come into fruition. Everything I do has a purpose and passion behind it. I don't need to be motivated to do my workouts, to eat clean, to wake up early, to work hard. I just do it. I'm so hungry for the next three years and what's going to happen. Nothing is guaranteed, but I am training for Milan Cortina, the 2026 Winter Olympics. Ready or not, here I come, you can't hide. check. I think we are live. So how did I get into bobsled? This is the question that I'm asked almost every single day. And while most have seen the Disney classic Cool Runnings, feel the rhythm, feel the rhyme, get on up, it's bobsled time, Cool Runnings! <laughs> or have seen bobsled in the Olympics before, many don't know how the athletes get started or how they find the sport. And if you aren't familiar with bobsled at all, it is a sport that was invented in St. Moritz, Switzerland, and has been part of the Winter Olympics since 1924. There are two events for the men, two man and four man, and there are two events for the women, monobob and two woman. And if you have followed me for any amount of time, you know that I'm always looking for the next thing that is going to challenge me, and this is it. Representing Team USA is a dream, and the journey has only just begun. Chasing the Olympic Dream, season one. I'm gonna show you how great I am. Great I am. Great I am. It is 5 a.m. and it is time to start the week. This kid's gonna be somebody better than anybody ever knew. I'm gonna show you how great I am. Our season training is in full effect. The sprinting session. Attack. We got Nikolai here. Beautiful day. off-season training. Looks like I got shot, but we're actually just covering up a tattoo. Here we go. So it was a little over a year ago that the Winter Olympics took place in Beijing. I heard about Charlie Volker, an athlete for Team USA, who tried out for the team and two or three years later, he was in the Olympics. And this inspired me because when I think of Olympians, I'm thinking of gymnasts who are walking on their hands before their feet or swimmers who are peaking in their late teens. And when I did a lot of research on the bobsled athletes, they were in their mid thirties, like 35. I'm 28, I'll be 31 for the 2026 Olympics and I'll be 35 for the 2030 Olympics. So I was like, I have a good eight years in the sport. So I'm already thinking long-term. I started emailing the coaches, blowing up their emails every single week. While I saw there was a virtual combine online, I started training for the 40, the 10, vertical, broad jump, and other features of strength and speed. After about three months, one of the coaches got back to me and said, while there's no deadline for the virtual combine, the sooner you could submit something, the better, so you could potentially be invited out to rookie push camp. I said, great, what are your top guys doing for these numbers? He said that the top athletes are around 220 pounds, 32 inch vertical, four, five, 40. And I was like, oh, I'm right there. I just have to train a little bit longer. So after continuing the train for these events, I submit all my videos to the virtual combine and then I go right back to blowing up emails. So I started emailing again weekly. I finally got an official invite to a rookie push camp in August of 2022, where it was a crash course overload of how to push a bobsled. At the end of the week, we had a test in the ice house, and then they invited back the top guys from the rookie camp to compete at national championships. National championships is held every year around September, and it is for the returning Olympians returning national team athletes, development athletes, and then new rookies. So I was one out of four rookies at national post championships. 
and this is where we got into a sled for the season. From this point on, I competed on the North American Cup for the first half of the season, and then I competed with the national team on the World Cup circuit for the second half of the season, competing in St. Moritz, Switzerland, Eagles, Austria, and Winterberg, Germany. It was a dream come true. I've always wanted sport to take me around the world, and as you get older, those opportunities get smaller and smaller. So the fact that I was able to make one happen is incredible. Dude, bobsled is so cool. Bobsled is like the hardest, like you get no money. Zero. No one knows who the you are. Nope. It's just energy. Those guys are psychos. Absolutely. So while I did compete on the national team my rookie year, which is very unheard of, I am not guaranteed to go to the Olympics. I want to be very transparent and open about that. The Olympic team is named the Olympic year, so 2025, 2026. Until then, we are competing on the North American Cup circuit, the World Cup circuit, and the Europa Cup circuit. Who gets named to the Olympic team will vary on a lot of things. Athletes getting injured, new athletes coming into the sport, who develops the most over the year, and it is up to Team USA to send the best of the best to try to bring home medals. So when I'm making these episodes and seasons about the journey to the Olympics, it truly is a journey. If I do not get named to the Olympic team, that is something that I'm prepared to make a video on, but I'm going to give this my all and nothing is going to get in my way. But I'm going to document the journey of chasing the Olympic dream. And here's to the next three years. It's one thing to say that you wanna do something, but it's another to actually do it. Very few will put pen to paper and actually take action. I don't sit on ideas, I do it. I'm going to pursue this to the best of my ability. And if I can push the standard of what is expected and make everyone around me better, then I've done my job. I have a lot to learn. I'm still new to the sport and I want to soak up every part of this experience. Ha 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 ha!